Okay, 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 okay. Gang. Yo, gang. So, I got this comment earlier in the week. Somebody was struggling with their drums. Don't know how to do drums. So, in this video, I'm gonna be running you guys down how to kind of just lay down drums. Now, when it comes to laying down drums, it really depends on what type of shit you're doing, right? So, for most underground beats, what sounds you're exactly using all depend on the genre of beat, right? Like, if you're making an Amir type beat, you're gonna want to use some Amir drums. If you're making something more on the style of, like, Dom, you're gonna be using, like, simpler trap drums, and you're not gonna be going crazy with snares and claps like Amir is, obviously, right? So, for example, we got this beat right here. Uh, this was a tutorial from yesterday, and, you know, I'll leave that in the link in the description this one it's on the simpler side of the patterns wise but it has two 808s right that do complement each other so i'll just play the drum pattern right now like when you hear that the drums don't sound too crazy or nothing but with the melody and the drums they all go together so when you're laying down drums you really want to kind of just go with the melody so usually how i start i start off with the claps and the snares if i want to add percussion like snares so first i'll start with the clap so let's i will go from the beginning here's a clap my process is really simple i just go with what sounds good so like the main things to follow have a two-step pattern don't throw in too many rolls don't make them sound weird like if i just threw a two-step on this it would sound just as good as what i had before like right like it's just not that bad right and then you just like and then you can just move notes go lower an octave add some rolls here and there like it just depends on the melody right like where that bass hit i just didn't put any hi-hats because it didn't sound i don't know right to have hi-hats there to be honest so that's for the hi-hats for 808s honestly i usually stick to this one pattern if i'm going really simple this is the most basic 808 pattern that you can get away with like that pattern right there is the most basic 808 pattern there is but again listen to your melody structure your drums around it then with snares kind of just hit them where it feels like you want to so like like where, where you where there's like an empty space you could probably throw in a snare but don't overcomplicate your drums sometimes i make that mistake too so yeah honestly it's mainly go with the flow type of shit start with your clap Put in a two-step hi-hat and then play around with that trial and error we'll get used to it you need to listen to music you need to practice those are the main things same with the 808 patterns you'll eventually understand when an 808 needs to be used and a hit and when it doesn't you know what i mean that's like the main thing with drums like knowing when to have sounds and when not to have sounds hit you know what i mean so e let me know down below in the comments if you guys want to see more videos like this any other tips stuff like that question for the video bro i don't even know bro what's your go-to uh fast food or some shit i don't know bro let me know down below in the comments that's me love you guys bye